What's up guys, JR Raymond back again coming to you from my house because uh, I feel like I've got something really important that I need to share with you guys, give you a little bit of a quick of a tip, make you feel better not only for bowling, um, but when you're moving around each day, so stay tuned. <laughs> All right, so one, a big problem that a lot of people have, including myself, and it's actually a really big problem, uh, you wake up with a lot of back pain, and back pain makes it tough to bowl, makes it tough to get down at the line, makes it tough to do a lot of things, actually. And back pain is usually attributed to tight hamstrings, tight legs, uh, your back, lower back is tight. Uh, usually it has everything to do with your legs, and it's really not anything going on in your back. It's usually just your legs are tightening up, which is actually connected to that lower part of your back, and it causes problems. So I'm going to show you real quick uh, a stretching technique that helps me. If you notice, like I haven't done it yet, but stretching now, if I reach, I can't even touch my toes. Like I can't, I can't get there. So uh, I've got a band that I have. I need to try and stretch to the point where I can get to my toes. Now that's not gonna be possible for everybody, but for me, I know my hamstrings are super tight when I can't touch my toes, like it's it's bad. So I have to, then I'm gonna put the, the, the band across my foot and I'm gonna hold it because I can't reach my toes. I'm gonna hold, I'm gonna pull back and I'm gonna stretch for 10 seconds. One, 1,000, two, 1,000, three, 1,000, four, 1,000, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Okay. I'm gonna loosen it up and it hurt. It should hurt. Like, I mean, it's a good hurt, but it hurts. Like it, it really, it burns. It almost like makes me sweat because it hurts so bad and do it again. One, 1,000. And I'm going to lean into it a little bit. Two, 1,000, three, 1,000, four, 1,000, five, 1,000, six, 1,000. And keep in mind, you got to want to try to get to a point because you're going to tighten that leg, your quad, you're going to tighten it up. Uh, because it hurts, so you're trying to protect it. Make sure at well, some point through the ten thousand through through the ten seconds, you loosen that up and get into it deeper. So relax that muscle and and get push yourself into the stretch a little bit deeper. Okay, so we're gonna do that three times. Let's see if I'm getting any closer. Yeah, see, I can already get my if I pull my toes back, I can already get my fingers to my toes. So that's good. I want to be able to get to the to the ball of my foot though to make sure I'm really loose. So I'm gonna lean into, the, ah, yeah, I'm gonna lean into this one really good. Oh, all right, one, 1,000, two, 1,000, three, 1,000, four, 1,000, five, 1,000, release the muscle. Six, 1,000, seven, 1,000, eight, 1,000, nine, 1,000, 10, 1,000. All right, that's 30 seconds. Let's see if I can get there. We're getting closer. What's up, buddy? Hi right, buddy, you gonna come stretch with me? Oh, see, I got a little superstar here. So now I can get to my foot, um, which makes me feel a whole lot better. And I'm gonna get, I'm gonna do that on both legs, and I'm gonna do it probably three times each day to make sure I keep my hamstrings loose because uh, bowling with back pain or bowling when you're not loose and stretched and flexible and limber is really really tough. So I hope this helps you guys. Uh, maybe uh, take a little bit of time of the year each day to stretch a little bit and get yourself into that point where you can touch your toes and you can get down there because now that doesn't hurt much for me. Oh, I'll see you guys later. Bye.